so now let's come back now one more numerical which is very interesting but uh, important thing is again it is the same elevation and boiling point concept so as i said whenever such numerical whenever you see boiling point here immediately try to write the formula the same story again delta tb is equal to kb into m further when you write the formula which i have already told in two earlier two videos capital m molecular mass that is your molar mass of the solute which is equal to kb by delta tb into w2 by w1 this is for the solute weight this is for the solvent weight and that solvent weight should always be in kg so let's come back and see now here first of all i have to see what is uh, given kb whether kb is given to me or not in the sum kb is given to me okay 2.42 kk by mole okay, that's unit uh, for your uh, ebulloscopic uh, constant done after that next what should i have i should have delta tb let's see with the delta tb is given to me they said a solution of 3.795 uh, grams of sulfur okay the solute is dissolved in 100 grams of carbon disulfide that is a solvent because this is in minor quantity this is a major quantity they said boiling point of carbon disulfide is 46.30 okay the basic thing and boils at 46.66 yes so what do they give me they give me two uh, temperatures one actually i know delta tb is equal to tb minus t naught b so now this tb value on t naught b both are given to us tb given to us is 46.66 minus t naught b given to me is 46.30 this comes to 0 0.36 degrees centigrade now done so delta tb is over now w2 i need to write so what is given to us w2 given to us is 3.795 grams let's see what is w1 given to us they said sulfur in 100 grams of carbon disulfide that is your solvent so w1 is given to me as 100 grams which is equal to 0 0.1 kg done yes so all the data is available let's substitute in the formula and uh, find out the answer m2 is equal to what is kb given to me 2.42 kk by mole in into what is w2 given to me it is 3.795 grams divided by what is delta tb given to me it is given to me i've got the answer of 0.36 into what is w1 w1 is 0.1 kg simple isn't it done now once you get everything once you solve you get uh, an answer of almost you know 255.1 okay gram per mole this is over but i still have to solve the numerical because they've asked me what is the formula of sulfur molecule yes one mole of sulfur that is number of moles if i cal calculate number of moles present in one molecule right so simple so i can use the formula n because n gives me that is your number of moles present in one molecule done so which is equal to weight by molecular weight so sulfur weight weight what did i get i got it as 255.1 kilogram kilo uh, per mole molecular weight of sulfur molecule is 32 grams per mole so gram per mole gram per mole gets cancelled and i get an answer of almost 7.9 or 6 or something which is approximately uh, with the significant figures i make it equal to 8 so the formula they want us to write or the formula which i've got is 8 that is why sulfur exists as 8 s8 molecule this is important s8 we have got in this way so what what answers did we get we have got two answers one is m2 that is molar mass of the solute equal to 255.1 gram per mole and your molecular formula which i've got is a seed. Please try to mention it like this so that directly you can get mark there also.